Seri Sunny Ken, perfumer, aroma therapy consultant of French Aromatic. Uh, today is 25th of December uh, 2023. So I wish you all a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year for 2024. Today I want to share with you a very interesting subject uh, based on my experience uh, of the past 30, 40 years in perfumery. Uh, if you were to start a uh, air care division or and also perhaps personal care division, today I'd like to share with you the roadmap and also my thoughts about how to achieve a success. First, in this presentation, I want to talk about the objectives. Okay, first you have to de decide what you want to achieve. If you were to start a air care product division and followed by a personal care uh, product division. And they also, uh, in this presentation, also, also uh, try to uh, point out why it's important to talk about the price range. Uh, and also, uh, when you launch a product, the unique selling proposal, like telling a story and so on, and the benefit as such, uh, the emotion benefit if you buy this product and also the fragrance usage. Uh, before I start any venture, I always review SWOT analysis, what's your strength, uh, what you want to achieve, and also the same P, same C, the uh, of marketing, and also most important, I think is the Pareto analysis that 20% or 30% of your product, you give you the majority of your products and keep your range small. And the other thing is, of course, your unique selling proposition. Uh, to start off with, with the air care, uh, where the entry cost is much lower than the cosmetic because of the regulations, they're not so uh, tight. As long as you can meet the VOC regulations as well as the Proposition 65 California and the also the wide range of uh, products you can add in or take out whenever you see necessary if it is slow moving then you can take out the product and launch a new one the what I find that is that in the weakness part is that in most of the uh, air care um, website they never know how to present the professional way of uh, you know marketing the fragrance or essential selection. The price range indication I also find that is also lacking. Now today I'm going to talk about five major segments in the website if you were to design it. First is the price indication. Second is the type of uh, scented products. For example, diffuser, vaporizer and scented machine. And natural scenting is another category. And the fourth one is a scented candle. And fifth one is the water-based rooms spray. Now the reed diffuser, most of, uh, all, uh, most of all is that most people know that it's a very price conscious. But I think here the design, and also you can also mention, you can have a transparent bottle, you can have ceramic bottle, you can have also red wine fragrances. You have the natural lavender and mint. So here you can also have waterless formulation and natural essential oil. But I think here the price conscious people can also make full use of the price categories. Uh, here the uh, ultrasonic, uh, the, here the humidifier where the technology is the ultrasonic chip to uh, beat up the water into a vapor and here you would talk again the price range and also the material of the humidifier you can have ceramic metals you can have wood plastics and so on and also the main benefit if you use this product the average fragrance oil I would suggest will be around 16 percent as long as you are VOC compliant and then the center machine, the technology is quite different from the humidifier. It's a pump system where you use it in the karaoke, uh, shopping mall, spa, 
and so on. The fragrance dosage would be about 12 to 15 percent. And then here, the fragrance family is very important to present your products. And of course, the, if you were to use the essential oil, there's another chart you can make use. Something about the fragrance oil and uh, essential oil. The difference between essential oil is coming from plant, uh, but the animal origin is banned because it's cruelty. Now, a lot of uh, the fragrance are coming from synthetic together with plant mixing together. You have the fragrance oil. Uh, in general, the fragrance oil you divide it into three parts the top, middle, and base part. Depending on the product design, you alter the ratio between top, middle, and base note. Uh, the, for some uh, awareness rules, you have to be careful. Like in the uh, fragrance oil, it could be colored, the natural oils like jasmine and all this and uh, resin oil, it could be powder form as well. And also it could cause allergen for citrus product. And natural products tend to be more expensive and they also vary in price depending on season and supply. Synthetic, the benefit is that it could be long-lasting, making the fragrance more long-lasting and also cheaper 